This video here that I'm doing is on the Google Maps app. And um, I'm on Android 4.4.2. And right now I believe the newest uh, maps that's out is 8.0.0. But I have downgraded to 5.8.0 um, with the app because there are features in that app that when they upgraded they took away and I just really don't want to live without so I still use that version of Google Maps um, also with that version maps and latitude and places and navigator are still separate in the app um, so I'm going to actually use places um, for this uh, demonstration of maps um, it's actually for the public transportation routing. Um, I don't know if anybody knows this or if it's a little known thing or other people are using it, but when I found this, it really just saved my life. Um, traveling and going to different cities and going to different places and wanting to know how to get around and not necessarily being in a car. Um, it's good to have this maps because sometimes you don't even know what websites to go to or what phone numbers to call to figure out how to get around in, you know, a new city that you're in. So I'm right now, I'm in Pennsylvania, so I'm just going to pick a, uh, train station here and show you, um, how it comes up. So you put in your destination and then you click directions and then it's going to give you the option for a car public transportation which is a bus a bike and walking so you pick the bus you pick get directions and then it tells you the time that's coming up the nearest time for you to catch a bus so see it's 744 in the morning there's actually a bus coming at 744 and then it just goes from there the next bus is 802 the next one is 753 now if you want a different departing time you just click departing time and you can say something earlier or later. Like, so let's say you want to leave at 2 o'clock in the afternoon. Boom. You would just put 2 o'clock there. You can even change the day. Okay? So, I love that feature. That's in the upgraded version as well. I don't think that that's what's distinctly different about this one. Um, and then you have the option to show later trips or earlier trips as well. Um, but when you hit choose one of these. So, I'm just going to go ahead and choose the first one. Right? It's a, it gives you the bus, and when you're actually on the different bus, even if you transfer to a couple of buses, it'll tell you exactly how many stops there are. If you hit that button, it's going to list what the stops are. And these blue dots on the left side, when you're actually in route, and you're moving like you're when you're using your navigator in your car, these blue dots, it'll be one blue dot that'll light up. And as you go to each and every one of these stops, it will light up from the first one to the second one to the third one to the fourth one and so on all the way down to your final stop. If you've got 30 stops, that blue dot will be lit up and it will be sliding down to 30 stops. The other thing I love about it is when you um, get to like the second to last stop before you're supposed to get off. My phone vibrates and then it sends me a notification that tells me get off at the next stop. And then when I get to the final stop that's listed, it will tell me get off the bus. Um, so it's almost impossible to miss your stop or to not know where you're going because this literally does the navigator inside of your route, um, your transit route, which is really awesome. The other thing is, of course, you can hit the navigator and um it will actually show you the navigator with the buses you know the bus stops listed there the streets um but it's to me it's not as precise because it doesn't give you the bus stops each and every stop it just gives it to you like when you're in a car um so when you get to that final bus stop it doesn't tell you to get off when you're actually in this part of the map the navigator section um the other thing i love about this is that it's a separate volume inside of the navigator so you can turn the navigator up separately um from your music so let's just say i have my music playing and i use the navigator 
And let's just say I have that turned on. I could actually turn the navigator up or down as well as my music so that my music isn't louder than my navigator. So it's separate. I like that. I like that having them separate in that they're not, they don't have to be the same volume. I can make my navigator louder than my music uh, or vice versa, depending on what I want. Um, and I, um, I use this app almost every day um, for different places that I'm going. So, um, I could even show you if you use it, um, it will show you, um, like if I wanted to go, like I said, I'm in Pennsylvania. Let's say I wanted to go to, um, New York, 42nd street, New York. It would literally, um, Give me the directions um, to 42nd Street from Pennsylvania. Let me just show you that. So you can even uh, plan how to get places from where you are. Like public transportation, it'll show, it'll show you. Amtrak, Greyhound, tell you how long it, it tells me at 8.02 I can go. And this is what it shows me. I got to start off here. I got to get on this bus. That bus has eight stops. So I want to ride that bus I can watch. Then I can get on this bus and take another eight stops. Then I can transfer to this bus, take another four. And then I'll be in New York. So there's three buses that would get me from Pennsylvania to New York. So, or three buses, and I think this may be a train, the Philadelphia 30th Street Station. Uh, I think that may be a train that goes from Philly to New York. But either way, you can get transit on how to travel um, far distances I never did anything like California but let's see if I wanted to go to um, Wilshire Boulevard and Beverly Hills let's see what it tells me no route found yeah they don't tell you all the way to California but I still think it's pretty cool that it could tell you how to get, um, let's see, um, just doing different major, uh, train stations in different places, yep. And it, tell, it tells me how to get to Georgia from here. This is the route. So I love this uh, app. It's good for, you know, local public transportation. And it can even tell you how to travel um, further distances, you know, hundreds of miles away. Um, I hope this video helps someone. Okay. Bye-bye.